here to defend it. We find out a little bit later in Malachi, uh, Malachi 2.15, it tells us why God did that. Why did he create the family? And it says because he wanted godly children from their union. Yes. And that's what it's all about. Marriage is about children. It's about the next generation. It's about transmitting our values to those yet to come. And we could lose it right here, uh, but we're not going to, and that's why we're here. You see, the fight for marriage is not just about marriage. Proposition 8 is not just about marriage. It's about everything else. It is, as I said, about children. It is about what's taught in public schools. It is about government. It is about uh, business and what business people are able to do and the laws. And it's about the courts because if they can unilaterally change the definition of marriage as long as it has existed in every continent on earth, it can change anything else. We've got to stop it right here. And the way to do that is through prayer. Thank you all for being here. Thank you for caring. Thank you for your love for the Lord, for uh, sending your petitions heavenward. And we're here to join our voices with yours today. Now, there are a few protesters here. We can hear them up here. I don't even know where they are, but I can hear them. And there's some others outside. I want to say something specifically to you. I want you to know that we care about you, and we're glad you're here. This is not about hate. This is about love. We love you. We're praying for you. And I know that many of you have uh, been through very hurtful circumstances in childhood, and there's a history there, not for everybody, but for some. And uh, that's of concern to us. So just know that we welcome you here. I understand your passion, uh, but uh, we believe that God has an answer for every situation. With that, with that, let me pray for you and pray for Proposition 8, which is going to take place on Tuesday. And uh, I would invite you to pray with me as I do. Help me pray, will you? Let's do that. Heavenly Father, we call on your name today, knowing that uh, you never lost a battle, and knowing that you care about us. I thank you for your invitation for us to walk boldly into your presence and lay before you the concerns of our heart. We do that today. Lord, I pray that you will save this great institution of marriage and that what happens in California will have a positive influence on the rest of the nation. We put this situation in your hands. We don't have all the answers. Uh, we don't even have all the questions, but we know who does, and we appeal to you on this day. Lord, I pray for the protesters, both inside and outside. The, uh, the stadium today, be with each one. Lord, if there are those here who have a hunger to know you inside, I pray that you will find a way to introduce yourself to them. And for the rest of us, Lord, give us compassion and caring for all people, including those with whom we disagree. We love you, Lord. Thank you for this precious time. Amen.